Present glass hydrophobic experiment on 6mm silver mirror. This has been carried out in our test facility, also known as the laboratory, at Unit 8, Ellesley Square in Brixton. We've applied the hydrophobic coating and we've washed it off. Now, we've also run the tap consistently for about 15 minutes to get us into a nice steamy state. We've also put plates at the bottom and filled those with boiling wick liquid. The mirrors are at exactly the same state, exactly the same temperature. There's no variance of those. And as you can see, we're getting a nice bit of steam on the hydrophobic coating. And ironically, not quite so much steaming up on the untreated. And the mirror above the sink, um, where we have the water running, has completely steamed up. So essentially on steam, I think it's safe to say that the hydrophobic coating doesn't help at all. In fact, could be a hindrance. Hydrophobic coatings are quite commonly used on shiners and things like this to help the water run off. We're just going to try, just like getting back to that steamed up mirror there. We're now just going to pour a tiny bit of water on the steamed up mirror. You can see how it beads and runs straight off there. We're going to now pour it on the untreated mirror. And in this experiment, it seems to be doing pretty much the same thing. I'll just pour it over. So for mirrors, at any rate, and for steam, the hydrophobic coating doesn't really work.